Now, when you open Windows Explorer, you will notice that there are four specified network drives. The first one is the IMS. The second one is internal. The third is clients and the fourth is an archive. The first was the IMS. The IMS will have one level of subdirectory. The second network drive was internal and the purpose of this network area is to contain all the information about the individual departments, the day-to-day -day running of the departments. The third network drive was clients. All the information relating to client management, client records and projects will be contained within the client area. The fourth area is an archive and under this archive area there is an archive for the other three network drives. So obsolete information about clients from the IMS or from the internal departments will all be contained in this area. A separate training exercise will cover each of the network drives for clarification and understanding.